Okay, here we're going to try the word bird. So, the simplest connection of these characters would look like this. But, now first of all, when the B starts a word, there's actually no need to include the word line. You can kind of just draw the B hook and then use the tip of it to connect off the word, like so. You could actually just do the same like this, too. You could actually connect off of it regardless whether you choose to add it there or not. So we can reduce it to this. This is shorter, so we're, we're going to prefer that. Uh, then we could, after we catch it, we could add the R there and even add the D there. That's probably the most likely to end up looking something like a bird, I'm starting to think. I'm kind of seeing a head or something. Um, let's see if we can't turn this into a bird quickly. So maybe that's the head. Mm. Mm. I'm not too pleased with that. Not really looking much like a bird, actually. Let's try using that as the hooked beak. No. Um. What else could we do to this? So we got this to start. We could do the I there. We could do the R and D here. That might look like a nest of some sort, and maybe even some sort of something, putting something into the nest. Um, so, RD. That might kind of look like a nest in a tree. <laughs> Maybe. I think this is most likely to somehow be able to be symbolically interpreted as a bird, or a nest of some form.